A lot of debate. News 2's Margaret Chadbourne has been doing some digging in on the story. She joins us now on how the GOP health plan could affect you and your family. That's right, Brandon. The dollar impact of a new bill it could potentially be deep. And for some we've talked to, that will mean financial sacrifices if they lose coverage under any changes. It would result in huge cuts to services, waiting lists for services, um, a limited number of slots. The Republican replacement to the ACA is hard for some in South Carolina to stomach. For the director of the Palmetto Project, an agency that helps people sign up for insurance, she says if the bill becomes law, it could hurt the elderly and those with low incomes the most. In the GOP repeal plan, there is no shield for poor people to be able to get coverage. Turning people out of care while you figure out a new option, those things to us um, seem like an unnecessary hit to poor working people. Whether a new system would be affordable is a major concern for David Ruth and his family. He's without a job and looking for work. He relies on the ACA and his son is covered through Medicaid. The monthly budget for his family of three could soon skyrocket. The direction it's headed right now, I would say, is, is makes it a little bit more uh, scary. Complicating cost, his son Christensen, age 17, is autistic. But he does require a lot of supervision. Ruth worries his son's health care coverage could be at risk under changes included in the bill. I'm not real sure what will be available uh, for him. The family is looking for additional resources to care for Christensen. There's very little resources left for us, but dollars aside, when I was working, what I would say is I wasn't really working for myself so much as I was working for my son. My son's never going to be able to really earn a living for himself. Now, the fate of the GOP health care bill will depend largely on whether Republican leaders can convince skeptical conservatives to support the plan. The vote is expected to be close. Real close, certainly divisive issue. We appreciate that, Margaret Moore. Uh